What's up, Happy Made Gang Creator Minds? This your girl, the Creator Mind of Bree, and I'm back with another video today for you guys. And today is kind of different, but I'm going to go ahead and pray a sin. I'm not going to be too long, but Father God, I thank you for today. Thank you for waking us up, Father God, and protecting us, Father God. Thank you for loving us and letting us be a vessel, Father God. Letting us be used by you, Father God. Thank you for all the benefits, Father God. Thank you for the love, the joy, everything of the fruits of the Spirit, Father God. And we take all, I take all of me away, Father God, and I ask that you come in, Father God, and speak through me, Father God. Let me put me aside, Father God. Even though I, I wrote things down, Father God, if you want to say anything, Father God, speak what you want to speak, Father God. It is all you, Father God. For the glory of you, Father God, in Jesus' mighty name, amen. So, I just wanted to come on here, y'all, and um, speak about when I was praying. I seen, if, as you see, it's a t um, the title. And those pictures that I put up there, that's what I seen. Um, not, not the angel. I just put that because I put the Bible angel of what was in the Bible instead of what, um, you know, people put out there to be an angel. But the description of the angel that was in the bible that's what i put on my title but um also the demon that i seen and also G um jezebel jezebel is, is who what i what i'm talking about so i was praying in the spirit and um i was just also you know the thoughts was, was and so i was praying in the spirit and um you know i was uh saying hallelujah or fire fire and it was uh getting into the jezebel spirit and it was this was in church that I seen this um this um snake not spider but the snake was inside of the church and the they was preaching and praying and everything I don't know what church it was I guess it was just a symbol of a lot of churches but uh, I made a video speaking about that too about um vision I had when God was saying while I was praying in the spirit room God was saying um keep his house clean his church clean so i guess that's another thing right there and i also i had to pray in tongues physically but i was um i had to cast her out and i prayed harder and harder saying hallelujah praising god and um also a demon came he had big muscles i didn't see him at first it was kind of like uh blurry and dark but once he was coming up to me I didn't even have to fight God's hand, um, came down, picked him up and threw him in the mouth. Like it was a wall and he just, and it just chewed up the demon. Um, I really couldn't see, um, but it was like a disposal. I guess it was, um, I had a knowing that it was, um, a disposal for other people, um, that they were attacking, but it you know, it, it had to listen to, I guess, God. It has to listen to um, the higher name. So it went against their own kind, and it ate them up. But, um, yeah, I had to pray. I seen the anaconda and all of, the, all of that. And the Jezebel spirit, I wanted to talk about quite a little bit about that because I had to, you know, face that myself. When I was praying, I was um, doing some deliverance. In the spirit realm, and I seen her, Jezebel, and God was telling me that was who that was. I was asking, like, who that was. Um, and like I said, I had a knowing that that was a Jezebel spirit. And that's why I put that picture. I look for a Jezebel picture, and that's the picture, the same one I put up of her. But she was more pale looking in the face. And um, just looking back, like, what am I doing? And, um trying to come at me but i was just pled in the blood of jesus not co even coming at me because i guess she already knew and when i'm in a, uh, the spirit room i just you know god is in front of me and that's who they see they see the they see christ they see jesus so that's who i was once i was praying i had a knowing i had a um like god is in front of me god that's who they see god is and this is his power making sure that i wasn't trying to do it on my own um, cause it'll be hard to cast my until you say the name of Jesus in Jesus name. Amen. Um, or just saying Jesus, Jesus, fire, fire from God. So I kept doing that, but I just wanted to tell people, um, I'm all over the place. 
I wanted to tell people, like, I had a, like, sometimes when you feel a certain way, like a sexual feeling, maybe someone is trying to arouse you or that Jezebel spirit is trying to come in and get someone through them. They're trying to make you feel these sexual desires or feel a certain way. And that's a lot of that in the, the church nowadays where how they speak in, how they're just the whole nine where they're, like I said, even when they're praying, sometimes they're doing a little sexual acts. Jezebel is getting through that way. Um, and I just wanted to, you know, come on here and say, if you're feeling that type of way, then you should pray against that. Pray that God uh, sees you through it, that he reveals certain things to you because that can actually um, hinder your walk with God. It can, you know, give her the key to take things. And I say her as in the Jezebel spirit because she is attacking a lot of people. And uh, um, it's not only in women, it's in men. It, 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 it um, cause trouble in the house, chaos, um, destruction, um, loss of things, just like the devil himself kills, still and destroy. So his plan and his agenda is still going to be with those spirits. And that other spirit, I don't know exactly what that demon was, but I know he had strong muscles. Um, and it could have been a stronghold now that I said strong muscles, but he had big, strong muscles and he was coming towards me kind of like a, you could see it on the, um, my, um, cover, I guess, but yeah, he had big, strong mu muscles, kind of like a uh, Ninja Turtle, kind of his back was like just big, like a football player, but more bigger in the spirit realm. So yeah, I be seeing a lot of them and I just start, you know, fighting them. Just use your, not imagine, your, yeah, use your imagination because that's why God tell us to keep our hearts like a child. A child is going to imagine things. We used to imagine things all the time, um, even an imaginary friend. Where you think that imaginary friend came from? Like, you have to be praying in the spirit also, though, so you can actually be there. Um, even the marine spirits, when I seen that one time, I seen uh, a whole bunch of gold. Once I found out that it was gold at the bottom of the, of the sea, and they they have a bank down at the bottom of the, of, of the sea with a lot of gold, and they've been giving us paper money, and they've been collecting the gold. And God says, whatever is on this earth is ours. We command the seas and the, the flocks of the air. So I commanded the flocks of the air, the sea, to align with what God says in the word. And that's they have to listen to what I said. And that has to come back to the children. And I prayed that probably a couple months ago. That they have to that all of that have to come back. That store that those riches have to come back to us because it's ours. So I pray that because we have authority and God said so everything on this earth we have dominion over. So um the 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 material things, gold is the material. It is a tool, yes, but it's also a um I'm gonna say a more a powerful tool. It's a lot of tools that a lot of tools that we need, but gold and um the way we trade, even if it's animals, even if it's um trade just objects, period, it has a profit. But our soul and our spirit do and our dominion, our authority do when we know that we know that those things we just call into place and um we 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 speak those things as the, though they were. So that's what you do when you're in the spirit. You, well, you can do. You can ask God if um, you you need to. Ask him, is that okay? Ask him, does that align with his word? Because, you know, we have the means to do those, those things and send angels forth. And that's what I also was still doing, you know, sending angels forth. And because I see that a lot of people are not praying there. They're, um, the devil is throwing certain things and they're not speaking with their mouth. They're speaking the physical way, but they're not speaking it, um, the spirit. And if you have the spirit of God, when Jesus died, he told them, um, you know, don't be sad. He's going to he's going to leave, but he's going to uh, a teacher is going to come for us. And that's the Holy Spirit. And we also have a gift that he gave us to us. God has given us tongues that we can receive them. So if you're ready to okay, I'm gonna hold it like that, because, you know, you've just seen it fit fall. But. um. Like I was saying, um, Holy Spirit help me. Ask God, is that okay for you to um to do those things? And um, like I said, we have dominion, we have authority to be able to do that. So 
yeah that's mostly what i wanted to talk about i forgot um because that that failed if it comes to my remembrance but that's really about it um like i said oh, that's what i was saying i seen angels come in and it was kind of like a you know a fight so it was kind of like a lot of people are feeling down depressed anxiety because of um the war that's going on it's warfare i told you it was warfare before i heard it and they were saying wake up you have to speak like i said go to dominion city georgia um on facebook on um youtube go to dominion city georgia on youtube and on facebook look at those messages on there you know they have a screen so you can see it i know they have prayers so um you can go down and see which one you are looking for maybe if you type something in i know authority we have a lot of stuff on authority speaking with your mouth you can't play dead like pastor neck and pastor steve always say don't roll over and play dead because if you roll over and play dead all they're gonna do is get a gun in the spiritual room and shoot you in the head Ooh. All they're going to do in the spiritual realm, they ain't going to care. They're, they're not caring about that. You see these mobs, you see these um, so-called like thugs, whatever. They have nothing on the devil, but the devil has nothing on God. Those people who in the world who think they're the hardest, the strongest, most powerful people they don't have nothing on the devil the devil was actually using them but the god has reigned reign over all he's on top of all he's above all so learn how to speak god says use your, your tongue is life or death when you in that spirit you start speaking in tongues god is praying for you you are edifying yourself your spirit you are building your spirits up your muscle so have more of that muscle than the, the physical if you weaken everything, somebody said it's like you handicapped in a spiritual. That's how people see you when you're not uh, speaking in tongues and or or um, speaking or or you know using your authority, your God-given authority. It was given to us. This earth was given to us by our Father who's in heaven. He gave this to us: the gold, the material, the everything that's around. Not the demon and his agents and people who think of they're going, they they think they're higher because of material that's actually under. So if they think that that's more, then they must be under all of that stuff because it's the zoe, it's the plants, it's the um, the plants, the material, the material plants the animals, the people, then it's the spiritual realm. We are spirit first. Our spirit should lead our flesh. Just like it's a, the Father, Holy Spirit, and Jesus, just like it's a mother, I mean, I'm sorry, father, mother, and children. That's the same thing with the spirit, flesh, people, um, animals, plants, and the material. So, if the materials is the last thing, and you're supposed to be up here, and you're selling yourself for material things, you're chasing that instead of something that's more higher that you that's 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 going to get get you more. Then you losing, you losing in the spiritual realm because that's where we are first. That's where we came from. So that's all I really wanted to say, you guys. I hope you got a lot just from that this um this small message. It's in a big impact. It's a small time, but powerful impact on you. So please comment, like, and subscribe and share if you found it helpful or you've seen it, you know, it can, you know, help others out there. Uh, I'll see you guys later. Bye. God loves you. And I love you also, but he loves you more.